Okay guys, so in this video I'm going to show you guys how to fix this um, reoccurring problem that happens, let's say I take one of these and it just won't go on there, okay? So these are just any transitions here, no transition will be applied. You might think to yourself, hmm, maybe I need to zoom in, maybe that will do it, but sometimes it just doesn't budge. So I pretty much understood now because of other awesome youtubers that explained why it's happening so now though i come up i came up with sort of a new idea how to fix it so what usually they tell you to do is to just go like this okay shorten this one let's see not that here shorten this one shorten that one and then voila it will work for you now the method, I'm just going to go back, so the method behind that, the idea is that it needs, when it's doing the transition, some background, because when it puts it on, let's say, here, so then it's pretty much putting, when I'm here, if you look here, when I'm here, it's putting part of that, okay, and if it doesn't have any, because if you didn't go like that before and then move it, then it has no, nothing to use, pretty much, so instead of defaulting to what I'm going to show you guys how to do here, which is an easy trick, it just doesn't let you. So I think that this trick is pretty useful. I'm going to show you exactly how to do it. But pretty much, I think for this shot, okay, I think that actually I should pretty much cut this one. So I can, you don't need to, you can do this trick for both, but I think an easier way is to just cut it like this on one of them because it's longer and I have enough but this one I really want to keep every bit of it okay so in the full frame okay so what you're gonna want to do is go here with your um, arrows 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 11 12 and we're just going to check over here metadata um, select this guy so we're at 30 frames fine so 12 is okay it's gonna be around a second around half a second sorry okay but you're gonna see at the end it's gonna be around a second so now what i'm gonna do is i'm going to just go here zoom in a bit, and pretty much here cut it like that okay and then so that's normal cut and what i'm gonna do here is i'm gonna go super zoom in and i'm going to use this tool to cut one frame off okay so that frame is a single frame and that frame I'm gonna go into speed and I'm gonna freeze it. Freeze frame, change, we got a frozen frame, it's a picture. So, what you're gonna wanna do with your picture is take it and you're gonna wanna put him right next to that guy and then if you do here, you can see there it tells you how long it is, how many frames on the bottom. So, if you do there, it's gonna be 13 frames, great. 13 frames and this guy, we cut a couple frames, now we're gonna wanna compound this. That turns it into one, doesn't really matter the name. And now you'll see you'll be able to do pretty much any um, thingy that you want. So let's try barn wipe for a second here. So let's say this guy or whatever. Okay, so why won't it work? Um, pretty much we're right over there in the middle. So if we get out of there, that's odd. So this guy we cut already, and this guy. Oh, forgot. So. This guy, you're going to need to cut it right here, the exact amount of frames that you added, okay? Because now it's just going to be frozen, and then you get this. So just go here, use your arrow keys to find where it starts to change. So there, right here it changed. So let's just cut it down to there. And then now it's going to work like this. Okay, let's just take, let's say, one of these cool ones. And you can see you can get a big one. Okay, and what it's going to do is in your transition, you're going to have a bit of a frozen one, which is okay, because I still think with especially the more crazy out transitions, I think that there's no problem for it to be frozen. You don't really see it as a bad thing much. So I think that this is a super useful tool to do, and a lot of times you can do it with your um clip from before so let's say this one i would keep without doing it i would just cut it a bit and then this one i wouldn't cut 
And then what that would give me is a really cool kind of like, if you have a person, they're looking and then it happens. So it makes it feel more dramatic that they're like stuck in place or whatever. It can be used, it looks like they used it in Star Wars, I'm not sure, but that's just a feeling that I got when I watched them in a movie, so that's something. And um, yeah, so hope you guys have enjoyed. Don't forget to leave a like and subscribe, and any comment about what you guys want to see if you like this video, please leave. I appreciate it so much, more than you could ever understand. It makes me feel so good to see nice comments, so thank you guys for everything, and I'll be back in the next video. Bye!